Let's take a check of the stock market right now. The Dow Jones down 160 points. The Nasdaq losing over 12 points right there, as you can see. Trading ended just about 20 minutes ago, while the S&P 500 ended trading over 20 points in the red. And those numbers come as analysts prepare for third quarter earnings reports, which could represent the second largest drop in history. Fox 59's Angela Gnode sat down with Mike Reeves from Strategic Wealth Designers to discuss what we can learn from these reports. So Mike, right now the market is trending at a higher level. Despite that, that positive trend right now, some forecasters are saying there's this potential massive drop coming. What does that mean and how concerned do you think we should be? Well, as far as a massive drop, we're just going to have to wait and see how the virus plays out, how corporate earnings play out here. But certainly when you're at all time highs or near all time highs and you hit any air pocket there, you could have a very, very big pullback. And what that means for investors is be prepared for that. Don't be shocked when you have a pullback in a really, really difficult time. Be prepared, have a blended approach, have some safety nets under your portfolio. Yeah, and some companies already really adjusting their estimates for the year. Do you think that there's going to be more for the 2021 outlook? Well, I think it's going to be up to the stimulus. So, you know, companies have priced in um, the fact that, I should say, the stock market has priced in the fact that there's going to be some stimulus. If we don't receive it, and even if you've revised your earnings down, they still could be too high, and you could have a, you know, a fall in the market here. So certainly companies have brought in their earnings. They don't really know what to think yet. They don't know how the vaccine's going to work out or treatments for the virus. So there's a lot going on here. Year, but in the midterm and the short, uh, midterm and long term, look for stocks to follow um, the stimulus package in the short term. You know, who knows? Yeah, President Trump recently tweeted stimulus go big or go home. So we'll see what happens. We've talked before about, again, the pandemic and how it's hurting some, helping others. What sectors do you advise as a buy now opportunity? Well, big technology, that has been in the driver's seat for a long time. Well-capitalized companies, companies that have, you know, an impact in a more important digital time. However, if you're looking for some stuff that's out of favor, there are some quality companies that are way down. And if you do get the stimulus to pass, you know, they do go big with that. You know, look for the mo uh, an area that's very hated, which is retail, because some companies have gone out of business business in that area, which has less competition, and large companies with good balance sheets, when you have more stimulus, you have more confidence, more jobs, and people will start spending. So that's an area, if you're actually trying to look for some value, um, you can certainly go to. But large technology dominating will probably continue to dominate for um, well into the future. Hey, Mike, thank you so much. We'll see you next time. See you next time. And for more information on this topic or any other money saver, head to fox59.com and click on the Strategic Wealth tab.